CITV this afternoon we've got Children's Ward. The battle is on to save the ward. It's Dr Stoker versus the rest. And since he's fond of Sister Meadows, it could be down to her. But now we're off to New York. Take off with Teabag. I want my birthday surprise. it then? Well, I don't know. Oh, this whole expedition is becoming ludicrous, like looking for eggs in a cuckoo's nest. Guacamole? What is that? Hey, you three. Oh, fabulous. You can't go parking this monstrosity there, lady. Move it along, like now. Come on, before I lose my head. I doubt if you'd miss it. Say what? <laughs> Nothing, nothing. She was just... Hey! What? It's thunder! It sounded like an explosion. Oh, give the boy an A-level. Okay, cop, freeze. Lock up on me. All right, move it. Yeah. All right, Lieutenant. Tickle the clouds. Now kiss the wall. Keep kissing! Mm, 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 mm. Oh, whoa. Oh. Hey, you, doll face. This is one very unusual motor vehicle you have here. Tell me quick, is she fast? A quarter of a million miles per second. A quarter of a... What are you, some kind of wise guy or something? Voschbahn Deutsch Technik? Oh, shut up. Yeah, shut your cake, old kid. Okay, get on board, Holly is. On board, now. Well, must be joking. Or do I have to haul the convincer out of my violin case? We're convinced. Hey, Chapaloni. Whiskey, kiddo. Grip on yourself. You ain't seeing this. You ain't seeing it. Hey, fellas. Hey, hey, hey. This is one unbelievable stunt you're pulling here, doll face. I love it to death. And then some. <laughs> Arrivederci, suckers. <laughs> I've never been hijacked before. It's quite exciting, really. I gotta hand it to you, doll face. This is one truly weird setup you have here. But I am more than somewhat thankful that you happened along, for you have truly up and rescued my neck. What's in the bag, eh? I bet it's diamonds. I bet you robbed a jewelry store. You blew up the safe. Yeah, that's it. And now you're on the run with a bag full of stolen diamonds. I'm going to be a private dick when I grow up. Keep talking, bub. And growing up is the very last thing which you will do. Okay, Titch. I want you to land this crate back on Mother Earth before I get to say hello again to my lunch. No, oh, shut up! Hey! <laughs> do, do, do. As the nice man says, darling. No, wait. No, wait. Hold it. Hold it. The entire city will be crawling with cops out looking for yours very sincerely. Somebody tell me quick. Where in this town is the very last place they think of looking? The police station. Oh, forgive my little chum. You're about as much use as a fence round a cemetery. No, wait a minute. Wait a minute. The cop shop. That's not bad, kid. Okay, put us down on the roof of the police station. Yes, sir. Firing retros. From there, I will take my leave across the skylights. Landing. Terrific. Welcome to the roof. We hope you had a good flight and we'll fly with us again real soon. Have a nice day. This 
is one lippy kid you have here, Dollface. You have my sympathies. Adios, suckers. <laughs> that mouth of yours is gonna get you into serious trouble one day. So please don't stop talking. Right, 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 right. Now that little irritating diversion's gone. Somebody get me my birthday surprise! <laughs> Good evening, Constable. Lou Tennant. Oh, it's so nice to meet you, Lou. Now, can you point us in the direction of where my birthday... Button it, Broad. You're under arrest. Under arrest? What? What for? Don't you come the little innocence act with me, Buster. Now, be good little people and get your hands over your heads. No, not again. Now, I expect you all know what the charge is. We have to pay. Shut up! Aiding and abetting Villas Mobstam bags him alone in his escape from heist on jewelry store. What? Hey, I was right. Jewelry store raid. The shirt is well chuffed. Last seen driving Malone's getaway vehicle. We are looking here at 15 years in the slammer. Minimum. Each. <laughs> Lieutenant. There seems to be an itsy-bitsy misunderstanding here. Sure as heck don't. I saw you, you did it, I caught you. You are going to jail. But we were taken hostage. Tell it to the judge, fella. Now walk. Real slow. What do we do? We extricate ourselves from the situation using the subtlest means we can. Leave it to me. What did you do that for? That is assaulting a police officer. Another 15 years in the slammer. Minimum each. Oh, shut up, you idiot. He can't arrest us now, can he? Not while he's out cold. Tell me, Mrs. Einstein, now what do we do? No, now we run. Oh, no, you don't. You pay. Shut up. I'll get you. So help me if I have to turn this city on its head. And when I do. Okay, fella. Let's go. Now, oh, come on now. You hook in here. Now. Trust you, trust you to get the empty one. This is a disaster. Oh, my lovely headdress, my hair reeks and stinks of fish mackerel. I was talking about Tao Ling. Oh, He's cares? been thrown in jail. Who cares about him? Oh, more to the point. How am I going to get my birthday surprise? I can't even walk the streets to find it. There's only one thing for it. We're going to have to find that bags him alone, hand him over to the police and clear our names. Ah, well, obviously, obviously. I thought of that yonks ago. <laughs> but he ran off, didn't he? What did he do? Leave us a calling card or something? In a manner of speaking. What's that? Oh, it's nothing much. Just a major clue. The Blue Cockatoo Club. 42 West 22nd Street. Just call me Colombo. Are you sure this is the right place? Oh, can't you trust me to do anything? I'd rather trust Moby Dick to host the lovely oh. legs contest. It says it right there, doesn't it? The Blue Cockatoo Club. Oh, you won't find him in this dump. We will. I have a hunch. That explains why your clothes don't fit. I vote that we split up. You look over there and I'll hang about here. 
We won't find him in here. Oh, don't argue with me, woman. Go on. And if you see him, holler. You look cute when you get sloppy. Fish lips, this is Bagsy. Put me through quick, otherwise you will very shortly be taking a trip down the East River on board a concrete raft. You follow? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tell him I have the merchandise right here in front of me. Oh! <gasps> Anything Al, neat? Baby. Yeah, sorry about that. A little bit okay. It's Paxi Malone. Oh, uh, yes, I told you we'd find uh, him here, didn't I? Wife. But oh, no uh, doubting Thomas Shirty yeah. always Al. knows best. So, so what's I the plan? Can't. What's the plan? <laughs> <laughs> no, seriously. I don't know. He'll come yeah, yeah. to me. He'll uh, come uh, to me. Yes, 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 yes. We take the diamonds back and give them to the police. Oh, oh no, what? What? What, what? What, what? What, what? What's he doing here? This is just terrific, isn't it? He's coming this way. Oh, we're sunk. Oh, no. Look, look, look. Female jazz musicians want it. Oh, no. No, no, no. Operator, get me Chicago 232322. Yes. I wonder where my baby is tonight. Two to two, two to two, two to two. What? Oh, say hi, gorgeous. Is this the purple parakeet club? Blue cockatoo. Oh, I blame the draft from the window. You want to watch that? Look, doll, I'm up to my eyes here. What do you want? Oh, say, a little dicky bird told me that you're looking for female jazz musicians. Huh? Oh, did you hear that, Nancy? We've come to the right place. Oh, forgive my manners, manners. I'm Florence Lawrence, queen of the high and the low seas. And this is Nancy Clancy, trombonist, trombonist. Isn't that right, Nancy? Yeah, right, Florence. Uh, oh, yeah. Hi, Al. Uh, hold on half a sec, would you? Okay, Goyles, uh, you're hired. Well, go ahead. Don't just stand there like you never heard me. Get the work. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Well, you too, huh? Oh, yeah. So, you're going down river? What? Sorry, Al. Now, where was we? <laughs> Not in here. Out there. Sheesh. This is it. Oh, shut up. Keep blowing. Then you get an idea. Whoa, yeah. Come on. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, This girl's just great. This is exactly what a hard-pressed cop needs after a long day. Say, Bob, you the manager? Uh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Uh, you sure bucked one swell act here, mister. Many thanks, Lieutenant. Th Say, do I know you? Uh, I hardly think it likely. Sure I do. Now, I've seen your face someplace else. No, it's always been right where it is, at the front of my head. Uh, I gotta go. <laughs> Sit down, oh, yeah. buddy. Now, let me get you a drink. Waiter. Now's your chance. Get the bag with the diamonds. I'll cover for you. Well, buddy, you stay here. I'll get him. <laughs> oh.
Take a bow, little lady. What the place? You! Oh, stop. Stop. Sorry, officer. Yeah. Wake up! We've got to get out of here. Oh, give us a break, Lieutenant. We didn't do anything. Do I look like a liar? Frankly, I'm afraid to tell you what you look like. You like playing with fancy bracelets? Try these for size. Whoa! Absolutely spiffing. Another 15 years. Oh, oh shut up. He went. That way. Come on. Their keys in the ignition. I'll drive it down the street and pull the bars out. I'll have you free in no time. And all before I turn ten. Cool. You get the reward from the jewelry store. Oh, the reward! Oh, thank you, thank you! Oh, I know, I know, I know! This is my birthday surprise! Oh, thank you! Thank you, Lieutenant Constable! Officer, thank you, thank you! Thank you! This is from the jewelry store. Another golden envelope! What?
The only thing I missed from the um, previous series of Teabag was that at the end of each programme, a voice used to say, Next time on Teabag! I thought it was quite good fun. Um, I asked them why, and um, they wouldn't say. They were too busy making up more jokes about tea. That's the Teabag lot. Now, what have we got next? Children's War.